What's up, peeps? Okay, I'm tired. Um, so I did a couple things today. Popped a couple things out. Um, first, the Hello Kitties. They're still kind of dry. I'm not really excited about that one. I don't know. I don't know how great that turned out. Anyway, Imani, be kind. Be kind to your sisters. Use kind words, please. And then there's her. I, I like her. I actually like the way her, her face and her bow and stuff turn out. Because I'm going to do every color. Hello, kitty. So, for right now, those are the ones I have. And this one is like, um, like a blue, midnight blue. This one is the pink. And then that is the yellow. These two need to be glazed and they're still drying. I just got to do it now. I got that bow. I need to make this bow. And I think I have a. Yeah, I do. I've already got them in it. That one's already glazed. That's so pretty. Look how shiny when it's glazed. I can't wait to, to glaze that. And I'm thinking about like putting the chain on them and. Having the bow either at the bottom or connecting to it from a chain on the top like that for a little necklace or, or something like that. Or maybe I have two little bows like this, one on each side, and it can, like, connect through the ears. That would be cute for, like, a little necklace, kind of. Not that color, of course, but whatever. You get what I'm saying. Who knows? I don't know. Um, so I need to glaze those. Hopefully I'll get some tonight. I don't know. Uh, all my little dots of paint that I've used to paint the faces. This is what I use to paint their faces because I don't have the moolah to go and get like the real cool expensive tools. So this is what I use over it and I'm same color. I just wipe it off a baby wipe or something and I use this to get in sometimes in the deep corners <laughs> I'm cheap I know I'd rather spend my money on stuff that I actually want like resin and all that jazz this is one of my entries for the um, resin addicts because they're doing a fantasy or something like that so this is or a fairy tale. I can't remember. This is one of the the things that I've done for that. It's just got a little blue background. But I did it like this because I wanted to like be like the Cheshire Cat's smile. It's my moon mold that my fantastic buddy, Miss Britalicious, gave me. I absolutely love it. It's the first thing I've got to do in it, and I'm so excited. The only thing I'm upset about is that um, some of the transparent um, stickers I used, like that one, you can't, you can't hardly see it. And the birds are actually showing up a lot better than they look like in real life. And there's just lots of flowers on there that's not showing up. That one doesn't really show up when you look at it straight forward. And yeah. I don't know. But I think it turned out pretty decent. Says Alice, you can't say, see the In Wonderland. Because the In Wonderland part is blue. But yeah, that's that one. Then I did this princess one. Not really happy about it either. <laughs> I know you guys are probably thinking, get over it. But there are no bubbles, which is the fantastic part about it. But once again, I use those transparent stickers, and they really are transparent because you can barely see them. You can see that one. You can barely see these. Then there's a butterfly you can barely see. You can see them a lot better, actually, on this than normal even that because even that is a transfer and just barely able to see it um when you're looking at it straight forward but look where i put my my green supposed to be like grass tinsel whatever 
it was too thin. I don't know how I missed that. It actually looked fine in the mold, but, you know, sometimes that stuff migrates and, yeah. But I like the way this started out. I tried this out and I bought like a huge bag of them. So I love that. I hate that my towel is only a 4x4 four four because it would have been nice to be able to send all the princesses because I have Tiana that I would have loved to put in here. All my Tiana sections were way, way too big and I would like to get Mulan, but I don't think anybody sells Mulan stickers. I love Mulan. And Anastasia. Wait, is Anastasia even a Disney princess? I don't know. Um, I know I showed a lot of these other pieces in my other video. Yeah. I don't know. Okay. Oh. I don't know if you guys saw that. Isn't it cute? So freaking adorable. And my pink panda. I need to. I didn't mix my color. Okay. Hey, settle down. Nevaeh. Nevaeh. Settle. She's sitting on you, Nevaeh. She's two. You can get up. Nevaeh. She's so dramatic. Yes, yeah, she can. She's almost five, and her sister, her baby sister, is two. And she's fussing because she says she's sitting on her. Whatever. They like to get each other in trouble. And if you've seen any of my videos, you know my kids are never quiet. So I apologize for the screaming, but there's nothing I can really do about that. So, yeah, that was my panda head that I need to do something with. I'm not really sure what I want to do. This part glows in the dark, but I'm mad about that spot. I'm probably going to... I was going to try and decorate this with some crystals and stuff anyway, but... Yeah. So, yeah, there. That's... Oh, yeah, crap. I forgot about these. Remember, you guys? I don't know. It's my resin attic girls. No, because I put, like, a post-up, really short post one day, saying I'm off to try and make a lolly, a lollipop. Okay. So, those, that's my first clay lollipop. And I got to get a stick. I just bought the glaze, because I didn't know you had to buy glaze. I thought you could use resin. If you can, let me know. But I did buy the Scopey Gloss Glaze or whatever I guess you put on it after you bake it. And I made a tiny one for like a charm. I got the hole in there. I just need to put the stick in there. And this is the bigger one. And it's got a hole in there ready to be baked. So I know that these are like nothing to most of you guys. Because I know most of you guys are like really advanced and clay. But these are like my very first things to, that I've done. It's like this is the second thing I've ever done in number three. So yeah. These are my butterflies that I've done and I've painted on. And um, this one I did too. This is purple. It keeps showing up blue, but it's not blue. It's purple. And these are like some aqua circles. And then you got the plain blue with the glitter on the background. And what I'm going to start doing for people is like wall hanging. And I'm going to put them in different, they're going to be different series of colors. So my first series is going to be black and white. And what is, all of these will be just black and white. This will probably be white, 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 white. And then I'll put them so that they're hanging like this. And people can actually dangle them in like, you know, their nurseries and whatnot. Just to decorate the ceiling and stuff. So, yeah. Well, the rest of us. I'm starving to get